Hey foodies, welcome to Cooking Shakling. This is your boy Yaman, and pizza is something we all love and indulge often. I'll keep my basic pizza recipe for some other day. Today, let's stir up some Szechuan curry pizza bites. All on tawa. We're going to begin by making the dough, for which we're going to take a cup of flour, a teaspoon of salt, tablespoon worth of milk powder. Half a teaspoon of yeast proofed in warm water with half a teaspoon of sugar and a teaspoon of oil. Mix the ingredients to form a clumpy mass. Now take this down to the counter and knead it to a soft dough using warm water if required. All smooth. Place it in a greased bowl for an hour to proof. Once doubled, divide the dough into two portions. Take a portion and roll it down to about five to six inches. Break this all over with a fork. Now this goes on top of a warm tawa, and we have to cover it with a lid. You can also use a pizza pan instead of a lid, like I am doing here. Now we have to cook the base in very low flame for about three to five minutes. Flip the pizza base and cook for another couple minutes. Covered. Now take the base out and repeat the process with the another part of dough. As the pizza base is ready, time to assemble it. Spread Szechuan chutney all over the pizza base. Follow it up by a slice of cheese. Sprinkle in a good sum of masala e magic or your favorite curry powder. Next goes in the veggies. You can use any vegetables that you like. Here I'm using onion, peppers, and corn. Season the veggies with a dash of salt, and we're going to top it off with broken slices of cheese. Time to place it on the tower to get baked in low flame, covered for four to six minutes. Once the cheese is melted and the bottom is brown, we're going to take it off the pan. Sprinkle in a little bit of your favorite curry powder and slice it down to bite-sized chunks. Now all that's left is to serve this. Little bites to appease your cravings. This Szechuan curry pizza is amazing. Try it out and let me know how you liked it. Oh yes, Q and A coming up soon, so ask away your food cues in the comment section below. That's all for today. Smash the subscribe button to receive notifs as soon as we publish new recipes. Thank you. Bye. Take care and happy cooking.